Hello friends, today we will discuss this question. We have to find the area of this quadrilateral ABCD. We are given that this quadrilateral is a concave whose one interior angle is reflex angle and all other three interior angles are 30-30 degree each. This side AB is given as 4 units and CB length is 2 root 3 units. We have to find the area of this quadrilateral. To solve this question, we need at least two constructions. One, extend CD uh, such that the extended CD intersects AB uh, somewhere at this point and from this point draw perpendicular to CB. So we will have the intersection point E and from this if we draw perpendicular so this point is F. So EF is perpendicular to CB and CD is extended to E. Now since this angle is 30 degree, this angle is 30 degree. It means that BE and EC are equal and this angle will be exterior angle and will be sum of these two remote uh, interior angles. So this is 60. And if this is 30, this is 60, then this will be 90. So to get the area of this triangle, half into base into height will give you the area. And to get this area, half into base into height will give this area. We know that this thing, the whole length AB is 4 units and this whole length BC is 2 root 3 units. Now if uh, this is 90, this is 30, 30. So this uh, uh, CE is equal to EB and this uh, 30 degree is 30 degree and this is 90, so this is 90. So these two triangles are right angled triangles and hypotenuse EB is equal to hypotenuse EC and this side is common. So by right angle hypotenuse and side test or we can use angle angle side test angle angle side test these two are congruent and we can say that this CF and FB are equal. So CB is divided by 2 and this becomes now FB is root 3. This is also root 3. Now by using 60, 30, 90 theorem. This is a right angle triangle. 30 degree and 60 degree. So this is 30, 60, 90 degree triangle. And 60, 30, 90 degree triangle theorem is the side opposite to 30 degree will be half of the uh, length of hypotenuse. If hypotenuse is A, then this side opposite to 30 degree will be A by 2 and side opposite to 60 degree will be root 3 by 2 times of the hypotenuse and this is root 3 A by 2. So using this fact in triangle EFB so EB is hypotenuse. So we can say that EB is hypotenuse. So EB by 2 will be FE. And EB root 3 times EB by 2 is equal to root 3. So root 3 and root 3 will get cancelled and then EB is equal to 2. 2 into 1 is 2. So this is 2. And this is also 2 so because this is 4. So this is 2 and this is 2. If this is 2 then EB by 2 this is 1. And if this is 2 then this is what D is half of the hypotenuse because this side is side opposite to 30 degree. So D will be half of the hypotenuse. So this will be 1. So this is 1 and this is 1. 
So area of this ABCD is equal to area of triangle CEB plus area of triangle ADE. Area of quadrilateral ABCD. is equal to area of triangle plus area of triangle AD and that is equal to it is CEB area triangle CEB is equal to half base BC and this base BC is 2 root 3 into height is 1 plus half base is d1 into ad so ad is equal to this is side opposite to 60 degree so root 3 by 2 times 2 the hypotenuse 2 2 cancel root 3 so this is what root 3 plus root 3 by 2 so if we take root 3 common so root 3, 2 and 2 will get cancelled. Root 3 plus root 3 by 2. So root 3 is common. 1 plus 1 by 2. Which is 3 by 2. Which is equal to 3 root 3 by 2 centimeter square or unit square. And that is the answer.